Uh, my mother had been just missing for 41 years, and I think all the family members, uh, it got to a point where, you know, we didn't ever think she would be found again. But um, but in recent years, you've seen DNA and, and unsolved crimes being um, used uh, to solve uh, crimes that uh, are years old. Uh, there was a little bit of hope. Um, and then I got a call uh, in September about possibly giving some DNA um, for uh, some some unsolved uh, uh, crimes that had been committed and and, um, and some human remains that had been found and uh, had been stored for a number of years and uh, but I was also uh, a little leery because um, you know we'd gone through so many things over the years and, and a lot of disappointments and so uh, and they also informed me that you know I was one of twelve people that they were reaching out to of, of potential candidates that could fit what they were trying to match and and so I didn't get my hopes up and they told me not to get my hopes up um, and so I, I gave my DNA and uh, you know, roughly about six weeks later they called me and said uh, we found your mom as time moved along you know we all became at peace at, at that where she was and she was in a better place and um, you know, a lot of family and friends helped me grow up uh, whether it's high school coaches teachers brothers sister, uncles, and aunts. Um, it was kind of a village that took care of me, and, and uh, uh, it would be hard to just say only one person was, was important in my life. Uh, there were so many people that stepped up and helped me. I just felt teaching, coaching, um, being involved with people's lives, uh, you know, allowed me to do that. And, and I always felt like, you know, you work with all walks of lives, and everybody has a story. And uh, I felt like I was always going to be able to deal with people that have had hard upbringings and hard, hard things going on in their life, and I just felt that I could relate with those kind of young men, and and um, and I and I think I have, and and uh, I'm not done. You know, there's a lot, lot to give. Um, I love what I do. Uh, the, the game has been. It was. It kind of saved me. It gave me a direction. It gave me an identity. Uh, it paid for my college. Uh, I, I was able to get a college degree. I was able to turn it into a career. Um, you know, I have a family, and I've met thousands of wonderful people in my life. I've traveled the world, um, so I have tremendous amount of respect for the game of football uh, for all those reasons, and um, uh, that's why I want to continue to give back and be part of it as long as I can.